Coastal Highway. That thing stinks. Kind of reminds me of my... What was that for? Abandoning the mission. What mission? You dropped off the grid. My squad was scattered. <clears throat> and that? For coming back. You did good, rookie. No doubt. We're not out of this yet. Captain, how about you hang back? Let us clear a path. Agreed. Uh, I'll stay with the sure. asset and give it close cover. Oh, wait, who? Oh, I'm supposed to clear. Okay. I thought I was going to be hanging out with Virgil for a bit, but I guess not. Also, oh, we have shields because of Virgil, dude. I didn't. I never realized that. <laughs> I'm so dumb. Uh, okay, we're going this way. Fuck that turret has us pinned. We can't advance. Flank the watchtower, trooper. Take it out. Okay. Anybody want to draw his fire? Oh, there's multiple turrets. Oh, we're in a bad spot. My I'm grenade's better than yours. Oh, frame drops. Holy. I got an achievement. Of course. Oh, good thing I have this sniper here. Give me the headshot. Freaking grunts. There ammo here? Of course not. Why would there be? Why would I want ammo? Oh. I see, there's another turret. Well, I'm gonna need something. Oh. Use one of these. That is a definite yes. Captain, let's move. Where are we going? Exactly? I gotta jump off this way. Waterfront highway. Fastest way out of Ouch. the city. Alright, do we have any weapons around here? Because I need some. enough carbine ammo left. They still have a pretty decent amount of sniper ammo, so that's good. Oh! Well, I found the carbine ammo. <laughs> Just keep going this way. How far away can I be from Virgil? All the shooting, it's frightened. Want me to give it a little push? What do you think? Just trying to help. I want to see how far away I can be before my shields disappear. If they disappear at all. 
but he's sticking close. So I guess we're not gonna see. This way. Should be an elevator right through here. I hope so. Set tight. We'll need the alien to power on the switch. Alright. Just wait here for Virgil. And do okay. his magic. We're all set. Hit it, rookie. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Another cutscene. Oh no. We're gonna have to drive. When did this happen? They started showing up right before I went underground. And you waited until now to tell me that. Oh, I'm sorry. I was a little busy making sure perfume over here didn't take around and blow us all up. Eddie Buck, always thinking with his gun. You haven't changed one bit. Me? What about you? Oh, so full of big only secrets. Couldn't even give a guy a yes or no answer. That's not fair. Oh, you got that right. I never thought I'd see you again. Yeah? Well, here I am. We need to move, now. Were you too busy to plan our exit? I stole a phantom, yes, thank you. I hid it in the shipyards down the highway. But I only have room for two, so that thing's gonna have to sit in your lap. The engineer, where did it go? Great. And try to keep up. Now it's an escort mission Play instead of key. just a. Uh... Never fall for one. Make sure she's got balls. Okay. Whatever you say, Buck. Um. Take the wheel, rookie. All right, shotgun. Yeah, we could have just driven out of here easily. But now we gotta escort this big old, big old tank thing. Hey, uh, Captain? Pick a lane. It's a little crowded in here. The engineer's doing something with the control circuit. Hey! Watch where you put that! Gotta be kidding me. I'm doing the best I can. Just stay out of our way. Oh, oh no. Fuel rod cannons? Nope. You're dead. Oh. Well, that's what I get for trying to run over grunts. Take the wheel, rookie. <laughs> All right, shotgun. That's just me. Like, do I have to kill? You see that? I mean, I'd rather hey, just drive uh, past everybody. Pick a lane. It's a little crowded in here. The engineer's doing something with the control circuits. Please kill the fuel rod cannon, please. I'm doing the best I can. Just stay out of our way. Oh, I almost had all of them. Nice work. Did he say rear tire damage? That doesn't sound good. Sounds like it'll be bad for my handling. I'm gonna try to on. grab this. Oh, that doesn't have a gun on it. Get away from that thing. Have I gotten a checkpoint? Oh. oh. You're welcome, Buck. 
Dude, at least he gets in pretty fast. Oh, great, we have Banshees too. Somebody has fuel rod cannons. That's not good. No, that's it. Please kill that. Oh. Dude, I'm trying to dodge these damn cannons. Oh, hell no. Buck, you're gonna be need to do something here. Buck, can you shoot? Dude, it sucks not having any, like, firepower for myself. I gotta rely on Buck. Why couldn't we just get our Phantom to pick us up? I feel like it would have been easier. fine. We're fine. I have in my totally side. not worth it. <laughs> totally not worth switching Warthogs because basically back to where we were. The damn grunt and his plasma grenades. Oh no. See, I'm trying to see if I can find a Goss Warthog. Because, uh, you know, the turret, as great as the turret is, it's not that great. Especially when I have to rely on the AI for it. Hey, hold up! It's a Gauss Hog! Let's change vehicles! Well, there it is. You drive, I'll shoot. Fuck. Please get in the thing. Cars in the middle of the road. God damn it. Somebody left their car. Oh, you. These cars are gonna kill me again. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Get in. Buck. Use. Do we shoot the banshees? No. Jesus. You want to shoot the banshees? Shields are holding, but not for long. Yeah. Good, 
you're welcome. I don't know if, like, pointing at... I don't know if I can tell Buck where to shoot. So I'm just trying to, like, point at enemies and click. See if he does that. Oh no, we have a Scarab, we have a Wraith. Please kill the Wraith. Damn it. Dude, there's so many. There's so many to deal with. Shoot the Wraith. I see it. Must have dropped off one of those cruisers. Just keep driving. It hasn't spotted us. Please, please, Buck. What are you? Why can't you just shoot? Yeah, you want to shoot the Wraith? Oh, this freaking car. Damn it. Well. I see a Scorpion tank up ahead. We need the extra firepower. My shield can't take much more of this. Buck, you're fired. Get out, let me shoot. Buck, scare him. I see it. Oh, you're not going to drive. You're not going to drive. You son of a... Okay. <laughs> Apparently he doesn't want to drive, so we're kind of SOL. Please shoot the Wraith. There, it, he has target overload. I'm pretty sure he has target overload. Like, as soon as the Banshees come in, he starts, like, going all over the place, and he never fires because it's like, which one do I shoot? Dude, I, I don't know what to do here. I don't know what to do because Buck doesn't want to shoot anything. This is why I wanted to be the gunner, but nope. I see it. Must have dropped off one of those cruisers. Just keep driving. It hasn't spotted us. How the hell did you make it down this highway in one piece? There weren't as many covenant last night. Great shot. Yeah, I'm. I'm just trying to stay alive here. Okay. I don't know what was going on there. Alright, hopefully Dare is safe right now. Yep, I agree, because then I can shoot. Jeez, Buck, can you go any slower? Alright. Now feel a little bit more comfortable at least. Well, oh, they just dropped a wraith, so never mind. This looks scary. Am I missing? I think I'm missing.
Did I hit one of them? Get the damn turret. What turret? Oh, that turret? Okay. Don't mind me just driving backwards. Kind of. I don't know if that's considered driving backwards. I was aiming backwards, but I was driving forward. is this going to be? <laughs> Taking a lot longer than I thought. It's charging its excavation beam. But the dig site's on the other side of the city. Well... To tell you, I'm here. Your sister. Get away from there. There goes down. Careful. So Buck is on a turret. That's good. Because unfortunately this gun doesn't fire that much, or fire that fast. as a fuel rod cannon. I think, I think they're pushing me, but no not it helps. We're gonna keep rolling as far as we can. Get airborne, fly the phantom to my feet. Understood. Whatever you do, stay clear of that carry. Is that another one? It was. This would probably be so much easier with uh, a co-op partner. Because then you don't have to rely on Buck to, you know, kill everybody. Okay, I will get out of your way then. Is this considered an off-ramp? I'm gonna say yes. Cause there's a marker down here. Out of the vehicle, trooper! Let's go! Oh. Alright. Jeez, we're finally done with that. 
That was a lot longer than I thought it would be. Veronica, wait here. Rookie, let's secure that building. All right, I think that's carbine ammo. Don't shoot him, just... I told you not to shoot, fuck. Area God damn. It. It's like uh, I want the sniper, but then I also don't. You know, maybe I should grab the sniper for now, and then once it runs out of ammo, then I can grab a carbine. There's a couple down there too. If I really need to get there fast. Ugh. Well, there goes my ammo. <laughs> Taking fire. Yeah. That's what I get for having tunnel vision. Did not see the suicide grunt. Can I use this rocket on the Phantom as it comes in? Like, what if I were to just shoot a couple rockets into that thing? Well, it's not terrible. Okay, that is. Alright, this is not going well. Somebody has a fuel rod cannon. Just what I need. This is bad. Retreat! Retreat! Oh. What was that? Oh, great, hunters. I should have saved the rockets. Beautiful. Alright, the fuel rod cannon actually worked. I'm very surprised about that. <laughs> I heard a sniper. But I don't know where the shots are coming from. Can't see him. Uh, 
All right. Now what? Is that it? Are we done? There'll be more soon enough. Of course, we're not done. Okay. Bad idea. Wraiths on the highway. That's not good. Additional contact. Okay. I don't have any more rockets. Holy Why? Why would you do this game? Can you be any more annoying? They just threw like 20 solar flares. Oh, delivery? Thank you. I was running low on ammo. Oh, that looks bad. That's bad. surprised very surprised oh they made it Very surprised. All right, there we go. That's it. That thing's safe. Long as it don't get hit. Epilogue. Extract from Mamba from Mombasa. It's over. All right. Easy does it. We went through hell for that. Give him some meds, would you? It's important. It knows things. <laughs> Honey, I wasn't talking about the alien. Mickey, I'm sending you a very special co-pilot. Oh, come on! I don't want 
one of those things in here? It won't bite, and unlike you, it knows what to tell those cruisers to keep them off our tail. I think they're too busy to care. Looks like they found what they're looking for. What about you? What about us? Win this war? Then ask me that again. And that should be the end of ODST, or not. Is it? Are we going to play, like, <laughs> the epilogue Lord now? Hood may have given I guess so. But it was my op, and it's my interrogation. We only captured one. It's very delicate. Don't worry. I know what the alien's like. Oh, look at that, it's Sergeant Johnson. It has access to the Covenant Battle Net? Limited, but yes. We're not entirely sure how it manages a remote connection to the... What? Whoa, stand down, stand down! Sergeant Major, please. It's extremely flammable. The brutes. The bastards who put bombs on your buddies and killed millions of my people. They're digging a mighty big hole. You're gonna tell me exactly what they're looking for, and then you're gonna help me stop them. <laughs> Alright. So I think that means this game took place between Halo 2 and 3. I don't really remember too much, but whatever. Uh, so that is it for ODST. Pretty short game, but it was a pretty good game as well. And it, you could probably get more time out of it if you actually like look for, look for uh, you know, all the audio logs and you actually explore the city a lot. But you know, I, I wasn't gonna do that. But it was it was pretty enjoyable. Uh, this is like the only Halo game I played so far that hasn't had floods, so maybe that's why. I liked it a lot more. It was basically just go in and fight the Covenant, and that's pretty much it. Uh, so it wasn't too bad. It was... I didn't really have too many issues trying to get through the game. I mean, really the only problem was that last highway mission. There was like one section where I had to drive by a Wraith. Um, and I had to rely entirely on Buck to shoot. So... That wasn't too great, but... After that, it was not too bad because I had control of the scorpion and I had control over the guns, so I could just shoot whatever I saw. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, overall, pretty good game. Interesting story, an interesting way to tell the story. I mean, we basically just went and found stuff that was left behind by the crew, and, you know, we had flashbacks to see what was going on. And that's just how you make your way through the game. Now, I think I did go out of order a little bit. I mean, you could probably go find the stuff whenever you want. So, uh, that means the missions, you could go any order you want, pretty much. Um, I think I went out of order a little bit, though. But, I, I don't know. I'm not 100% sure about that. But it wasn't... It wasn't that bad. It was pretty good. So I like the story. I like the way it was told. Um, I don't know exactly how it ties into like Halo Three. I mean, we obviously we saw Johnson there and talking to Virgil, but yeah, I'm not like 
uncertain about what was going on. I remember Puck was in Halo 3 as well, so... I don't know. But you know, it, it was just an interesting story. And it was fun to play. I, I like the ODST weapons, I like the silenced SMG, and I like the silenced pistol. They sound cool, and they have scopes, so you can kind of use them like battle rifles. You know, the SMG, there's not a lot of recoil unless you hold down the trigger for like two seconds. Then it starts bouncing a lot. <laughs> so you could use it like a battle rifle. And the pistol was pretty good, uh, especially because, you know, you can fire it super fast. Um, but yeah, there's not really a whole lot to say about it. It was kind of nostalgic for me, just because... Yeah, it just reminds me of the good old days of video games. <laughs> like, 2009, I'd say from like 2007 to 2012 was probably like the golden age of gaming. And uh, this was like right smack in the middle of it. I mean, I remember getting up at like 6 in the morning on a Saturday to play this game. <laughs> and uh, you know, I remember doing the same thing for like Modern Warfare 2, which came out like a couple months after this. But... Um, yeah, it was just like the time where I was excited to play video games, you know, everything that was coming out was cool, especially multiplayer stuff, you know, you had Gears, you had Halo, you had Call of Duty, everything was good. Um, so yeah, uh, I don't know, it was just kind of nostalgic. I know this isn't like multiplayer, but it was still like, just the setting, the, the HUD, the way that everything looks. The way the gun sound, it was just some nice nostalgia, I guess. But I enjoyed going through this game. Uh, it was pretty fun. I, I enjoyed it a lot. And uh, yeah, so now we only have Halo 4 left for uh, PC. Then I'll have to play Halo 5 on console because they never made it for PC. They made like a, a Forge thing. But they never ported the actual, like, Halo 5 game to a uh, PC, so that's unfortunate, but you know what? It's not that bad. So, we will be moving on to Halo 4. I will try to finish that up as quick as I can, and, uh, yeah, we'll see. So we have Halo 4, and then we'll have uh, or we'll play Halo 5 and then we'll be caught up for infinite and hopefully we'll be playing that when it comes out or shortly after I don't know we'll see I saw the PC requirements for Halo 5 and it's or not Halo 5 uh, Halo Infinite and I might be in a little bit of trouble with that because <laughs> my PC is kind of old and it might not be able to run it super well so that I'm a little bit worried about that and I don't have a Xbox Series X, whatever it's called. So, we'll see. But anyway, I'll, I'll worry about that later. So yeah, overall, uh, it was a fun game. It was an interesting story. I, I really like the way the game looks. <laughs> I don't know. I just, it's nostalgic, I guess. Um, but yeah, it was just a really good game, and if you haven't played it, I'd highly recommend playing it. As well as the other Halo games, it's just like... The classic FPS experience, I guess. Um, it's just... The entire series is really good, so... Yeah, anyway, I'd highly recommend playing it if you haven't. And if you have, play it again, because it's still fun. Uh, so yeah, that'll be it for this playthrough. Let me know what you thought of it with a rating and a comment. And uh, if you want to see more of my Halo Let's Plays and you want to see like Halo 4 and 5 and Infinite when they when I get to them, uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And uh, yeah, then next up will be Halo 4. So I'll move on to that as soon as possible. And... Yeah, we'll just keep going through the series. So anyway, that is going to be it. 
Thank you for watching, and hopefully I will talk to you all later.